Hello everyone, I have some exciting news to share. We can now bridge Caspa into the Ethereum network via a decentralized exchange called Change. This means we can convert Caspa into Wrap Caspa and operate in the Ethereum DeFi ecosystem and leverage a variety of financial activities such as lending, borrowing, yield farming, etc. Bridging from Caspa to the Ethereum network can only be done via the Chain Financial app. So today I want to do a step by step and show exactly how it's done. We will transfer some actual Caspa from my Caspa wallet into my Ethereum wallet. I struggled a little bit before doing all this today, but I think I got it now, so I will show you how it's done. This is very exciting. This is only the beginning for us Caspa holders, so let's get into it. Okay, and here's the article, Wrap Caspa, a bridge from Caspa to Ethereum. Here you can read all the details on how Chain Finance, uh, a leader in the cross-chain DeFi space, has successfully launched a native Caspa to Wrap Caspa, custodial bridge to the Ethereum network. Well, so what is Wrap Caspa? Caspa? Wrap Caspa is a representation, right? It's a wrap coin on the, on the ERC-20 standard, which is the Ethereum network. Um, it's not actual Caspa, it's just a representation, but we keep that value of our Caspa. And while we live in the Ethereum network, we can leverage all the DeFi um, protocols, we can earn interest, you know, we can we can uh, borrow, lending, etc. And then we can take that wrap Caspa, unwrap it, put it back in Caspa and send it to our wallet. So that's the idea. We don't want to lose our Caspa. I don't want to lose my Caspa. I think it's so valuable you know it's gonna keep appreciating the future this is just the beginning all right first thing i did i went to coinmarketcap.com and i searched for wrap caspa so let's let's do that wrap caspa and there you are wrap caspa so select wrap caspa and there you can see uh what's the value let's see well it's similar to the actual caspa right um there may be some fluctuations uh, depending on exchange but you know it should be very similar now what i did is i went back to here let's find it uh ethereum here contract so this is the actual ethereum contract you can see that's you can clip it in, you can copy to the clipboard uh add it to the trust wallet or uh add it to the metamask i have metamask so what i did is i click here and then metamask is gonna pop up and it says this action will edit tokens that are already listed because I already have it. In your case, if you don't have it, you're gonna this is gonna suggest to add the token, add a suggested token. So you know this is the real uh, contract. You don't wanna add, you know, a fake contract. So um, I went directly to Coin Market Cap and I said add token. I already added, so you're gonna have to do that. Just click add token, and then you have your you go to your MetaMask. And if you are in the Ethereum network, make sure you are in the Ethereum network here, right? You'll see your wrap Caspa here, WKS here. You'll see it. I have 20 right now after the first exercise. All right, and let's go to the actual website here. Uh, let me show you. I Google it and it's Change Finance. There you are, Change Finance. So it's have that change that finance. Um, and you're gonna need to download the actual app for Android or iOS. I did it for Android, but you know, uh, and you just click, and there you have the QR code. If you have, uh, you have iOS, just go ahead and download iOS there. All right, you need to install the app. We cannot do this on the actual site. It's not enabled yet, so we'll do this on the actual app on my cell phone. So I'm gonna have to um, project from my cell phone into this screen and show you how it's done, but go ahead and download your, your app here and install it. All right, I'm here projecting my cell phone. Uh, if you couldn't download, just search for in the Apple, I mean, Play Store or Apple Store. Uh, let's see, Chain, there, Chain, Chain Finance, that's the app. So I reinstall it, that's the app. Uh, now, when you install the app, you're gonna have to set up the recovery uh, Face, uh, phrase words, right? There are a total of 12. So write the words down, do not forget them, write it down, keep it offline, never online. And that's the, that's the way to recover the, the wallet. So once you install the wallet, it's gonna look like that. I have, this is uh, some of the uh, 
uh, assets that I transfer today. I transfer some Fusion because it does use some Fusion for some transactions. And then Caspa uh, from my Caspa wallet, there it is. That's how much Caspa I have right now in this wallet. Uh, there it is. And I transfer some Ethereum for gas fee. That's the problem with Ethereum, right? It needs gas fee and they're quite significant. Um, Casp the transfer from Caspa wallet to this wallet, it was super fast, amazing as always, Caspa. So, uh, go ahead and transfer some Caspa here. The way to transfer Caspa is you're gonna search for the asset here, Caspa, and then you're gonna do receiving address. And that's your receive, you're gonna see your receiving address there. That's the Caspa network you wanna have selected and that's, you're gonna copy that address and transfer from, from your Caspa wallet into here. It's gonna take a few seconds and then you're gonna see your Caspa balance reflected there. Okay, and then once you have your Caspa here available, what you wanna do is we wanna send this Caspa to the Ethereum network. So we're gonna go here, the three dots, click there, and we're gonna send. And then let's try let's try 50 Caspas first. Uh, spot here it has to say Caspa, so say continue. Now it has a change contact, but I don't have anyone available. So you click here and then you're gonna find a to a blockchain address. So you're gonna select blockchain address and here's the the key step. You are not gonna select Caspa here, although it says CAS address, you're gonna select Ethereum. And the CAS address here is the actual uh, wrap Caspa on the Ethereum uh address on your wallet. So you're gonna go to your uh, MetaMask wallet. I'm gonna click here, MetaMask. And then on the Ethereum network, make sure you are on the Ethereum network. I'm gonna copy my address here, copy. And then you're gonna go here and you're gonna paste that address here. All right, you're gonna paste it there. All right. Now, so let's, let me repeat that. So you're gonna take it from your MetaMask Ethereum network, Ethereum network here, and you're gonna copy that into the actual uh, Ethereum, although it says CAS address. So you're gonna paste it there, and then you're gonna say pay now. Right, pay now, you will send 50 CAS. All right, pay now. And it says your transaction will be executed on Ethereum. So go ahead and type your passcode. You should have set up a passcode with this uh, wallet when you set up the wallet. Congratulations, you pay your contact in progress. So order status in progress. So what we wanna do now, so the Caspa went from Caspa network to Ethereum network, although I set a Caspa address there. Uh, so we, what we wanna do is we just wanna keep checking here on MetaMask, um, and we should see the, the amount of Caspa reflected in the WCAS here. So that's that's when we're gonna know when my $50, I mean my 50 CAS get uh, created here, I'm gonna see 70 WKs here. All right, so let's keep checking. And there you are, less than a minute, I have my wrap Caspa in my Ethereum wallet now. This could be treated as Ethereum, but it's Caspa, right? It's Ethereum wrap Caspa. Um, so now uh, it's awesome. It took like less, less than a minute. So now we can go into any um, of the of the DEX or any of the uh, decentralized finance uh, sites. This is Aave. Uh, this is let's go to Uniswap here. What I'm gonna do here in Uniswap? I, I connected my my wallet there. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can search for Caspa, there it is. Caspa, the price is unavailable yet, but it does recognize my Caspa in the theory now, so that's good, let me see. Yep, it does recognize my 70 Cas, uh, Caspa in my Ethereum, so now uh, you can do anything that, it's not yet available, but we can do anything uh, on Uniswap, and that's the idea, the whole idea, right? To have those Caspa uh, on the Ethereum network. Now, let's see if we can swap uh, some of the Caspa on the Ethereum, the wrap Caspa. So if I go to swap here, uh, there is the wrap, I oh know that that's wrap ether. So wrap Caspa right there. Uh, if I do max here, 
select a token. Let's see if we can switch that to, let's see, wrap, let's see, polygon. Uh, let's see, fetching best price. It's working, it's trying to see. All right, there it is. Yeah, we can we can send that Caspa on the tier network, wrap Caspa from the tier network into and transfer, I mean, and swap it to for Matic, Matic, right? On the polygon. Uh, still, we are still on the tier network. So eventually we're gonna be able to do everything that we, you know, you are able to do on on Uniswap in terms of uh, lending and, and yields and all that. All right, let's check Aave quickly. I'm gonna launch the app here. We are in the tier market. Um, let's see. I don't see Caspa, Rap Caspa. No, 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 no Rap Caspa yet. I'm pretty sure we'll see it one day. Uh, otherwise, we could probably provide it and, and get an APY here just by supplying it right to, to the market. But not yet. All right, so that's it. I think uh, we were able to transfer Caspa. That's the way you do it. You need the app. Uh, I did contact the company. Apparently, uh, change uh, finance uh, will be able to provide this bridge on on their site uh, that's in the future for now it's just the app so you need to download the app if you want to transfer that caspa uh, i think this is so bullish uh, it opens up the the finance world for caspa i hope you guys enjoy this video let me know if you find it useful uh, thank you for watching i'll see you in the next one